I've been training. Cool. Yeah, like, yeah. What, like contact as well too. Yeah, I just don't kick anybody with this one. Okay. Yeah. Well, what can I get you? How, uh, like, what will make you be like, all right, I'm confident in kicking again? Yeah. When it doesn't hurt to like. When it doesn't hurt to. Yeah, even like like if it like, yeah, I just I don't know, it's just like a scary thing. Just you're not, you don't feel secure with it right now. Yeah. I got you. Yeah, yeah. Okay. All right. Well, I'm gonna lay on your back. Let's get moving. I'm gonna show you a couple of diff different like jumping stuff as well too, and then you cool running on the Alta G today? I just didn't bring my you shoes. Oh, you yeah. didn't have okay. that. Yeah. Sorry, boy. You're good. You been running at all though? Nah, not running. Nah. Just cause the the last part of the run, like like my foot, uh, the last like the the push off when I'm getting like all the way extended on the toe, yeah, is still like. I miss running now. I'm out. Walk on to my And then let's go through uh, the offseason. I want you to do cap phrases. You know how to do cap phrases, though. Yeah. The one I want to coach you through is the kind of like the plyometric stuff. So, okay. Um, let's do. I'm going to show you this one first. Give you like a kettlebell. We're going to do single leg RDLs. But I want you to keep stable foot position with the big toe so that way we can introduce load back into it. Okay. So, be left foot, right? So. I'm going to have you here, and then go ahead and just practice that position, just get that down. Yeah, I'm, I'm going this way, right? Yep, facing this way, and then I want that big toe, I want the top of the big toe here to press it down. All right, and you'll see, like, it's hard to keep that down with big yeah. toe, put, put pressure on it. Well, what am I doing, RDL? Basically, RDL, yep. Good. And then I want you to swing that leg up. On the top, good. Let's do 10 reps, take a break. We'll do like three sets of 10 there. Come here, once you go as high as you can with the resistance, and then we'll go into pogos, all right? We'll get switch up, we'll start with like the single just stationary here, and then we'll switch into directions. We'll go forward and backwards. Okay. Cause I like these cause it helps reduce a little bit of the gravity. So like if you can't tolerate just doing this here, yeah. this is a good alternative to ramp up into, then we'll get into like the pogo's different series there. Okay. So, yeah. And you're staying on the toe the whole time? Yep. And then you can even change it up a little bit, bend the knee a little bit more and keep that position, stay bouncing there. Good. And then speed it up, speed it up, speed it up. Yep. Five, four. Three, two, and one. Yeah, that's the part. That's the like last part. It's close though. It's very close to yeah. getting uh, to be a better. And so, if you wanted to, you can like go up a little bit higher with the resistance as well too. So like less, more help, more help, and then obviously up here, the most help, right? Gotcha. So that way you can control how much gravity is affecting that big toe at that point. Four, three, two, one. And then the next series, we can change with the direction now too, right? So we'll go side to side, back and forth. You can even do like the cross, one, two, three, four. Um, and then eventually that, this would be a good transition into doing the pogos, just free weight. Okay. Yeah, being flipped, fluid, fluid. He does not want, he will do them until like, and then eventually we get to the point where you can go into like single foot too. So putting it in different directions, ends, backwards, right? And then going into lateral steps, right? So you can progress the pogos. And I like this one, man, because that's just what the big toes make you do, right? Yeah. Being able to throw force and quickly dissipate it, so. Yeah, it's better. This is just the problem right here. This the extension there? Yeah, that's, that's the problem. Okay. But it's getting, it's, it is better every, it's better yeah. every, every week. I mean, in a sense, like what you were doing too would be uh, exercise in itself too, right? So like the position that does bother you, right? So it's like, since putting the foot out here and then getting into the yeah, extension yeah. here, I mean, I would do some sort of calf raise that will mimic that. Okay. So this would be too much maybe, right? Well then. Yeah, maybe, like what we're doing, I think we're doing that here. Yeah. And then just gradually bring it more back when you can tolerate it. And then strengthen yourself in that way as well too. Okay. So do the RDLs, and then I want you to do at least 25 calf raises, single leg, build up to it. So if you can't do 25, then break it up. We'll do like fives, 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 fives. Okay. Um, and then that's what I'm gonna challenge you to do at home as well too. So. Yeah, yeah, I can do that. Yeah. We do that.
Yeah, yeah, so I'm gonna go check out on Kyle real quick. Okay, yeah, and, uh, it, Chubby back in there. If not, Joey, I think should be back here soon. Okay. Yeah. Make sure that the big toe is also engaged. Oftentimes we tend to to work on our lesser toes um, and we forget about a big toe. So also make sure that the big toe is, is the, into the yeah. 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 Try it if you want to. Try it. Try it. The hat's probably big though. I have a huge head. I can't even hit it. I would try it. I would try it just on both feet. <laughs> Think about wherever your head goes, that's where the ball is going to go. Ah. Like, if your head goes down, the ball is going to go down. Okay. If it goes this way, then the ball is going to, like, so you want to follow your head. Like, wherever your head's going, that's where you have to be. Okay. I'm really going to bring, I'm going to bring you guys one next Wednesday. This, right, will, be, right, this will be like the spinery everybody will be doing, I promise. It's so, it's, it's, it's addicting. Once you start to get it, you're like, oh, okay, here we go. Yeah, yeah, I'm ready for the ring, man. <laughs> or no, 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 not the ring. What is it called? The, the octagon. The, the octagon. ring, too. Yeah, this yeah. is more of a boxing, boxing thing. <laughs> all right, all right. I'm taking all the... Yeah. <laughs> I always try to get you to sweat every time you go. Good. <laughs> That's a major concentration. The hip is on fire, too. Mm -hmm. so. All those muscles we've been working on. You're doing good though. Huge part, man. You're doing good. Five, four, three, two, one. Time. What is it? I don't know. I don't, I don't even know what I call it. But it's like your like reaction. Yeah. You'll just be like, ah, oh, I'm done with it. And the next day you'll come back and you'll be like, boom, boom, boom. And once you start getting going, you'll be like, oh, I love this thing. Yeah. <laughs> I go on walks every morning with my family and I'll, I'll, I'll just be hitting the ball. <laughs> you can go forward, backward, you know? Yeah. But uh, I like that. I like that, man. Cool. Okay. I'm good for today, brother. <laughs> That might have been more on my hips and the 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 monster walks and stuff, you know. Even that is just like yeah. <sighs> knee stability, foot stability, it all comes from up here. Not not the not the big butt muscles, right? The little tiny guys. The, that's what we we're talking about today. Yeah, we we're yeah. just talking about that. The media is so good. I'm glad you felt that. Cool. Okay, thank you, man. Thank you, guys. Appreciate you guys. Appreciate it, man. Yeah,